Chief Meteorologist Chris Boone. Now a little bit on the humid side across the Concho Valley. That's because that dry line started to drift a little bit further towards the west. Heat up in towards the Texas Panhandle along the border of New Mexico. As a result, we've been again seeing those showers and thunderstorms really kind of developing in towards that area. In towards the Panhandle, up towards Lubbock, just out starting to see them kind of fire up in towards the maximum heating of the day. Lingering showers in towards the southeastern parts of the Concho Valley. That's still those storms that kind of lingered from yesterday, kind of meandered off towards the southeast. And again, widespread in circulation, but we've seen that increased cloud coverage for us here in the Concho Valley as well. Those high clouds are really kind of moving in for much of the area. On the radar, though, and not as much activity as what we saw yesterday. Some of those lingering showers and storms as they started to work their way in from the southeast starting to kind of fizzle out. So seeing those rain chances kind of dwindling for areas like Mason, everyone else not looking at a whole lot of activity as far as those rain chances are. So much calmer conditions for us today, though, not quite done with the rain. We saw beneficial rain for much of the Concho Valley yesterday with those showers and thunderstorms really kind of picked up in towards the Coleman area, moved down towards Brady, while another area started up into the Mason area. Heavy downpours right in towards the the northern parts of Kimball County. That's all rain totals getting closer to four inches in some spots. That's why we saw those flash flood warnings during the evening hours. And then those showers kind of developed in towards the Mertzen area. So some beneficial rain, though pretty scattered in nature. Did see that kind of pocket where it didn't see as much rain for us here in San Angelo. And again, for our far western counties, Unfortunately, didn't see a whole lot of rain for Sterling County, Reagan County, or Crockett. So again, we'll still hang on to those rain chances as we go through the next couple of days, and hopefully they can get in on some of that rain action for the later parts of this week. 90 degrees right now in downtown San Angelo. So plenty of high clouds across the area. Those dew points a little bit on the humid side with them into the low 50s. But you can definitely see where those clouds and those showers kind of moved in towards the far southeastern parts. We're seeing temperatures into the 70s and 60s thanks to that cloud coverage in those showers. Much warmer for the towards the west. We've seen those temperatures climb up into the low 90s. So again, that temperature uh, mostly because of those showers kind of lingering into the southeastern parts of the state. Though as we get into the evening hours, temperatures cooling off into the mid 60s. And then tomorrow we'll be right back where we were today into those low 90s. So again, temperatures either at or below where we're at. And the 20% chance of those showers and storms, though we will see a breakdown in that high pressure. We've been seeing those temperatures into the 90s. That's going to start to work or start going to weaken as we get in towards the weekend. That's going to allow for those temperatures to kind of cool down back down into some 80s and 70s for much of the area. Well, we also hang on to those rain chances, so that's likely to continue. Now, as we get in towards the weekend, I think Friday and Saturday, that's going to be more of the washout day where we start to see those more widespread showers and thunderstorms. That could be our next best chance of picking up some really beneficial rain for much of the area, very similar to what we saw last night where we saw those rain totals really kind of running up across the area. Rain chances continue for the next couple of days, very isolated in nature, but by Friday and Saturday, 70% chance, and those rain chances likely to continue in towards your Mother's Day.